few of my black beauty zucchini plant grown here. She's a bit chewed up here at the moment, but she's doing pretty good. She is doing pretty well. Um, really big leaves, nice big healthy leaves, green leaves. Um, grown with compost from my vegetable scraps that I have. Should be harvested pretty soon at around four or five inches, five, five or six inches, as they get more tough as they grow bigger. So you want to take them out uh, when they're short. I think that people know what a zucchini is. What is a zucchini? This is like, wow, what is that? That comes from the ground? That is amazing. Yeah, they're pretty easy to grow here. And it's great, it's January in Puerto Rico. And I have zucchinis. That's the beauty of growing here. The power of growing here in Puerto Rico is that you could grow year round. Have vegetables year round. Instead of having 85 to 90 percent of the food imported here. I also have flowers here. Can you see? More flowers. So more predatory insects could come and eat the bad insects. We need some beneficial insects, so you grow these, and I also grow them for the bees. And these are my holy basil plants here. Holy basil, Tulsi. And right here you have bees coming in. They love this plant. I love, I love to watch these bees work. Very peaceful creatures. If you don't bother them, they don't bother you, and that's how we could live in this world. And they pollinate everything here, so I'm going to have more, more flowers coming out there. I, I planted some sunflowers here. I have a borage there. And um, everything is symbiotic. Everything is symbiotic in nature, and everything works together. You don't need chemicals or anything like that. So, if you need any tips on growing zucchini, write a comment down below.